have a burst pipe in my attic. I know the plumber. He said he'd be around as soon as he'd finish his breakfast. That was two hours ago. And what he's having for his breakfast, I do not know. Eggs? He'll be having eggs, the same as everyone else. And of course. He can't be having them boiled or fried. That'd be too quick. He's probably having them made up into a souffle surprise. There's hundreds of different ways of doing eggs. Father, oh, well, you must be trying a lot. I can see him standing there in his boiler suit. The only problem with a certificate from the Cordon Bleu. Variety is egg-shaped. And so is your umbrella. Only they were me while I eat me eggs. Eggs is versatile. You can do anything with eggs. Well, try using a couple of them to block up that pipe. Oh, this soldier is a soggy. <laughs> Nasty, isn't it? Yes, I am sorry. Who is it? Just, just hang on a minute, will you? No. To whom are you speaking? You! <laughs> it's a Mrs. Sinclair asking about her husband's leg. <laughs> oh, no, not again. Either we or the hospital have got to change our number. Get rid of them. Hello. Hey, how? Oh, give it to me here. Hello. No, madam, this is not the matron speaking. <laughs> you want to be put back to who? A doctor? She means me. <laughs> no, madam, that was not the doctor, that was our gardener. No, I assure you, our gardener is not tampering with your husband's leg. <laughs> no, no, madam, oh, your lovely. husband has not got his leg cocked up in any of that. <laughs> Look, take me. Somebody to the hospital. Oh. You'll only let me... <laughs> no, madam. Look, I'm trying to tell you we are not... Let me do it. Oh. Yeah. Thank you, George. Hello? Now, he's had a good night, yes. Mm -hmm. And he's as well as can be expected. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, George. Oh, keeps him happy, doesn't it?